What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I was looking for a cell phone holder that can mount to the windshield. So I picked up this. Hey, this is my Wumpow. I think it's just pronounced Mpow, but I've had a lot of luck with Mpow stuff in the past, so I thought I'd pick this up. And this is a suction cup phone mount. There are various reasons you might want this, and I can explain the reason I want it, but you know, you used to see these things all the time on windshields holding GPSs uh, so that they're up at eye level. So much of that has now drifted to the center council, but I think there's a good reason to have a suction cup mounted one for the window, and that is because I want to actually mount my phone so that I can record some video uh, through the windshield, window and through the windshield because I want to do um, some follow-ups on my cars and I want to show that to you what that driving experience is like more than just talking you through it So first of all, we have two pieces uh, the base here and which has a little plastic piece here it Looks like if I pull this away. This is actually really really sticky um, I mean, let me see if I can show you how sticky that is So it's kind of like those dashboard mats. I think if you take some water you can reinvigorate the stickiness if you lose it, but on top of that it appears that uh, it's suction cup mountable too. And if I flip it over, you can see this little switch right there. So if I pull the switch, what you might be able to do and see here is that it draws in that bottom. So not only is it sticky, but it is suction cup enabled. So you really have two forces holding it to the, the windshield glass. Everything is plastic here, but you can see we have a screw down here so I can adjust this arm. So let's say this was angled down like this. I can have it facing me. I've got a little ball joint right there. I can tighten this down. I can unscrew this little screw here and boom, this sucker comes out. So now this is almost maybe six and a half, seven inches long, which is kind of nice. So I can get some reach with it and screw it down. You can see the little track right in there. Now I have the phone holder itself, which is pretty robust. It's actually pretty thick. And what we're gonna do to mount it is take off this little collar, first of all. And then you're going to put the collar over the ball there. And then you are going to take the little socket there and press it onto the ball. And now when we tighten this down, what it's going to do is it's going to clamp down those four prongs around that ball joint. So if I loosen it a little, what we can do is move it around. But then as soon as I tighten it down here, it's going to stay in that position, which is nice. Now there is a little foam backing, so you don't have to worry about it getting scratched. And... What's also nice is you have this little deployment button right there. So you can see it's on springs and then you can see the teeth right there. So as it goes in, you can hear it ratchet and close. So it should hold the phone in nicely. You might be able to see there the edges curl in a little bit. We have foam on the side, so you should be able to squeeze in your phone. Now down here, we actually have some splay out legs, which will allow you to, let's see, I think they will just swing out like this, uh, create a little base that the phone sits on. It also allows you, if you have a, plug or something like that dangling from it that that'll fit but even when they're folded back in you can see how flush that is so if you didn't notice that they were there you'd be forgiven but now you can hold your phone on the windshield glass just like that so i'm excited about using this and getting some footage inside the car uh, with you here shortly so stay tuned for that and check out my other videos but if you do want to pick up this mpow phone holder for mounting to the windshield, you can pick it up at the link in the description below. Peter Von Panda, out.